two of you just squabbling over me like two little boys in a playground. Well, I know what I'm going to do, and both of you are just going to have to deal with it. Then tell us, my love. If you're going to choose him, babe, just get it over with. Who, who do you choose? Neither. I choose neither of you. What? You can't mean that. Well, I do. T.C., I realized that when I chose you, I chose in haste. And now this pulling and prodding at me, it's just... It just makes me more confused. Eve, but you chose me. You chose our family, our home, everything. Yes, and who knows? Maybe that's what I will choose eventually. But right now I'm just so wound up. I don't even trust myself to make a right decision. And, and I've got to be certain within myself. I'm not going to let either one of you force me into a corner. Eve, come to your senses. Aren't you listening to me? That's what I am trying to do. But when you pull at me, it just I just can't stand it. The only thing that I know for sure is that I'm going to do what's right for Whitney and for Simone. Your family needs you. Especially Whitney. And Simone. Simone does too. You said that Simone is fine. What's wrong with Simone? Nothing. Sweetheart, what are you not telling me? What's wrong with Simone? What's wrong? I, nothing. I, I just mean that I'm worried about my girls. And, and they need me. And... I need to be here for them more than I ever have before. Well, it's late. It's been a very emotional, trying day for all of us. I'm going to get some rest. Let's just sit down and finish eating. Do you see? After everything I said, I can't, sweetheart. I just want to get a good night's sleep. Then we'll, uh, I'll drive you uh, back to the mansion. You're home. Her home is with me. Please, please stop. No more tonight. I am not going home with either of you. Eve, but... this is silly. Eve, where are you going to go? I need time. Think things through. I need time to see what I'm going to do. I am not going to be forced into making a decision before I am good and ready. I'm going to go and stay at Sam's bed and breakfast. Oh, no. God, that's absurd. You don't, you don't have to stay in the mansion. You can stay in Sheridan's cottage. We have other cottages on the grounds. Oh, forget that. You can stay at home in your house. There's plenty of bedrooms. Just take a pick. Until I know what is best for me, what is best for all of us, I am not going to be near either of you. I need to be on my own. <laughs>